Wee, wee. Hey there, everybody. How y'all doing? Hope everybody's having a wonderful day or night. And welcome back to my channel. As always, I'm Deluxe. All right, let's do another freaking transform review because I love some freaking transformers. And today, we'll, and today we'll be taking a look at Mastermind Creations reformatted Asinox. I think that's how you say it. Let me uh, look at the facts again. I think it's Asinox. Yeah, Asinox and Symphony. Now, this is their versions of a, um, um, I'm sorry, Transtech uh, Cheetor, kind of a Transtech Cheetor, Cheetor and Rosanna and everything. I think he is a, um, either like a flash drive or a memory stick or something like that. I think that's what he is, if I remember correctly. And then, like I said, this is, uh, you know, a speed racer car, which looks very freaking awesome. I love it. Uh, but yeah, it looks pretty cool. Um, we'll go over Rosanna real quickly and um we'll just take a look at him real quick and very nice got the nice um kind of light blue metallic light blue right there and on the right there crotch area and you got the nice metallic pink and you got some hearts right there you can see the hands you know and then on the back you got the face right there which way did he go george which way did he go and you got the nice uh you know once again metallic and the metallic pink right there not much to him like i said it is a um i got a little paint right there uh got he's you know not much to him like i said he is a uh recolor of their rewind and everything so pretty cool and then you got trans tech uh the cheetor then you are uh what's the name asononics i hope i said that right asononics slam da, 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 da. let the boys onyx get it okay all right so this trans tech uh, cheetor like i said he is a recolor and a retool of their chrome dome i like that set the earlier you know the uh, the Chrome Dome and Rewind set that's really nice, and then you get this right here. So you got some nice uh, the spots. You got the nice uh, kind of turquoise blue right there, metallic blue right there looks really nice for the cockpit. Do got some gold throughout, very nice and you know outlined right there. You got the nice translucent wheels or rims. Here's the wheels with the gold on there, and you got some nice w uh, wheels up there. And on the back, you do got the thrusters, and they are nicely painted. That kind of a turquoise blue looks really good. I like that. Very nice. I like this uh, car mode. It's very nice. Our alt mode. There you go. You got the head. That's a new head sculpt. All that paint right there. Uh, it rolls pretty good. Uh, my, this is a really smooth surface, uh, but it rolls. You can see the front and the back's kind of moving like that. So very nice on the, that right there. Pretty cool. I mean, he can ride, I guess, up here if you want. If you want. Let me see. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty cool. But there you go. That's those two. Um, quick, let me look at you know the, the uh, accessories. Uh, it's not very much. You get the uh, two guns for uh, Rosanna. Nicely, uh, that translucent, or I'm sorry, not um, the metallic blue that goes right there. And you can move that down like there. And you can hold it like that. That's pretty cool. You get a couple hand options for Cheetor. You get the nice claws. And you, you get two of those. And you get one of these like that. And you get the holding hands because they are lovers. Now, it says it has a comic in the in the instructions, but this didn't come with a comic. So, I don't know really what the lore is from them. I don't know if they were in a comic together or something like that. If anybody knows, uh, definitely hit me up in the comments. I, I don't know where, you know, what they came from. So, but um, there you go. And there's another hand for uh, Rewind or Rosanna. Sorry, I'll call him. I'll probably mistakenly call him Rewind and Chrome Dome throughout. But there you go. Now, let me move this over here. Now, there's a couple ways you can have this uh, in his alt mode because... Um, on the box, as you can see, it's different from there. So I'll show you how you can move that over there. And so what you do is you can have it like this. You can open this up and flare these out a little bit. And that's pretty cool. So you can have it like that if you want to. And you can also untab the boosters or the thrusters. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna move this down on his nice little right there. And then you're just gonna tab that in right there. And then you can have this out that like that. Or you could, yeah, you also can move this and tab it right there. And then open it again. Untab from the thruster. If I can get it untabbed, come on, there we go. And then you're just gonna move this down like that. And tab it in there. And tab that in there. And there you go. Now you've got a kind of a wider uh, car mode. You know, and whichever one you like. I think they both look pretty cool. 
but this really you know looks nice so there and you also kind of have a, a weapon storage for him you can or not for him for the guns because he don't have any weapons um but you can this kind of looks weird i think it looks goofy uh actually and you can kind of tab this in right there maybe maybe it's this way i don't know eh, no it's gonna be like this I don't know. I, I would never do this, but you can kind of, if you, right there. But he's actually just shooting his, you know, wheel and thing. So I guess you can move it out of the way if you want to have it like that. But, you know, it's an option. You know, and options are always good. I think this might have been a fan mode or something. But there you go. Close that back up. Close that back up. And there you go. Now, these were, I uh, also forgot to mention, this was a MMC or Toy Dojo um, exclusive at BotCon uh, this past weekend that I was at. And uh, so there, you can, I think they have them on uh, their website now up for order, uh, either pre-order or order right now. So go to Toy Dojo or Ages 3 and up and uh, you can get these two. Uh, I paid 110 for them both. So I don't know how much, I think they're probably the same uh, online as well. But uh, yeah, these were at the show and um, they're on their website now. So there you go. All right, back to transformation. Here is Asononics and Rosanna. Um, I think I may have called him a male. I mean, he was, you know, and, and he, you know, it's just a recolor of Rewind, uh, but it's a female character. Uh, so if I called it a male, I apologize. Uh, it's a female character, but you can call it whatever you want to. It's your transformer. All right, so we'll take a quick look at Rosanna real quickly, and we'll drop it down a little bit because uh, she's a little shorter. All right, so here they are. And it looks pretty good. I so said, I think this is a straight recolor, uh, same head mold, no re sculpting or you know, retooling or anything like that. Uh, you can have the guns back there if you want to, or you can take them off. They just plug in right there, and you can flip it forward and have her hold them as well. So that's pretty cool. I love the colors on the on the guns. That's nice metallic paint, and. She does have another hand. It's on a ball peg. You just pop this right off. It's a little tight, but be careful. And you can have the little slapper. A little slap, 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 slap right there for her. All right. We'll take the guns off real quick, and we'll do some articulation. So this is on a ball peg, so you can look down quite a bit. It's on actually a hinge, too, as well, but it's on a ball peg. So you can get a little wiggle waggle, a little add to, swivel all the way, look up quite a bit. And everything 
Love the uh, metallic blue for the visor. Pink for the uh, face mask. Once again, you've seen all this. You got some nice pink paint right there and the metallic blue. That looks good. All right, you got the 80 with woman working shoulder pads. You can lift those up, go up to there, go all the way around with it. That's nice. You do have a nice double elbow, bicep swivel, hand swivels up and down. Like I said, it's on a ball peg, so you can get whatever you want out of there. Uh, waist swivel, ab crunch, and she can look up, so that's nice. I like that. doesn't defeat the purpose of having an ab crunch. You can van dam all day, every day, kick up kick back, thigh swivel, nice little knee bend too as well, about 90 degrees, uh, toe tilt down, and a nice a nice rocker, and you can toe tilt up too as well, so you can get everything you want for that, cleans up good, like I said, you got the face back there, mom, 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 mom. very nice, all right, so that is Rosanna, now we're going to look at uh, Asononics, I hope I said that right. I think it's Econonics or Asononics. Let me move this back up. And he has a retool. So he's got these, you know, little things right here. The claws or swords, whatever you want to call them. He's got a nice head sculpt. I love that head sculpt. It is beautiful. Now, real quick, I want to say during transformation, this is different. Like I said, it's a new head sculpt. You got this little head piece right here. It does move them down. Be careful when you're trying to pull that out. It, you know, it's a little thin piece of plastic. You don't want to break that off. Uh, just be careful, Darren. Uh, that's about the only difference in the transformation uh, from Chrome Dome is because uh, he's got that little headpiece. But beautiful. Love the metallic blue, the uh, gold throughout there, the red. I guess that could be like a maximal symbol. But that is a beautiful, beautiful head sculpt. I love it. So you can look down. Eh, nothing much really. A little wiggle waggle right there. Swivel and no add to it like that. So kind of lacking in the head movement. Wish it could look up and down. Been in cool. All right, so you already seen this. You got the nice tiger prints, nice beautiful gold paint right there, uh, and silver right there. Looks good. Gold got this turquoise right there. Very nice. So, as far as the arms, you can go all the way around, you can go out to about right there, not the full 90. These do move, you can have them up or back or whatever you want to. Um, gold right there for the arm or the for the elbows. You got a about 90 degree. Yeah, about 90 degree elbow bend. Um, you do have a bicep swivel. The hand is on a ball peg just like Rosanna. Uh, it does move around and everything. Now, this the hand does open up. It does have the booger picker right there. And you got the other fingers on one pin. And the thumb does not move. Now, you can also with this, you know, blade right here, you can have it, you know, you can untab, you know, untab it. You can have it out like that. And that's pretty cool. You can have it like that. However you want to, nice gold paint, really nice. All right, waist swivel. He does have an ab crunch, but he can't look up, so kind of defeats the purpose. So last I said, I wish that he could look up and to utilize that ab crunch, but you can't. All right, you got these little thing. Now these move up and down. You can have them however you want to. You can van dam all day, every day, and they will go up with it. And you can kick up to about right there, kick back, Thigh swivel, nice knee bend, more than 90 degrees. You got silver paint, gold paint. The toes, you do got the black toes right there. So you got toe tilt up, not much down. You do have a rock, or you have a swivel, kind of a, uh, what's his, uh, shin swivel, I guess you want to call it. Uh, so you have that as well. Now the art, or the uh, um, rocker is up here. Uh, kind of wishes more. You only get that about that much right there. It's not terrible, but yeah, it could have been more. I need the heel spur right there. That's very nice. All right. And the back cleans up really good. No kibble, just this little bit right there. And there's the back right there. All right. Now he does have a couple hand uh, options. I guess that'd be his weapons. So you can just, like I said, unplug that right there. And if you want to plug in the... Um, claws right there and he has a one of this like here if you want to plug this out or take this out right there he has this so you got that now he also has the holding hand option with her and so you would just kind of untab this right here or not untab but yeah that's in there 
There we go. Golly. And unplug this right here. And you kind of, uh, let's see. So it's going to be on this hand. Okay. So untab that one. And tab that one. It's kind of weird. Oh, I guess, no, yeah, okay, that's right. Thumb is right there. So you would have to kind of hold it like that and then untab, unplug this one and kind of have her like this and kind of hold it like that. And there you go. They're holding hands. It's weird. I kind of, I think that, you know, it'd be on that side, but nope, it's not. So there you go. That's that option. Um, like I said, I wish he did have a weapon. That would have been pretty cool, but there you go. All right, there's MP44 Optimus Prime. You got the Generation Toy uh, Bull Side Swipe. Uh, you got the Cheetor from Studio Series. You got uh, Prime. You got Brawn, uh, Core Class Wheelie, and Tiss McGee Redgar for some scale. From Crappagon's Crappy Tool Paper, AAA Battery, Carmex, Kicker, Squeaks, and the Care Bears for more scale. All right, let's talk about some Mastermind Creations. This is Reformatted Line. This is Ace Anonix, and I hope I said that right, Ace Anonix. And this is Symphony. This is a like a Transtech Cheetor and uh, Rosanna. This is a this was a BotCon exclusive. I got it at the Toy Dojo, ages three and up booth. Uh, these are probably on there right now. You can get them if you want to. I think it's either maybe a pre-order. You can you know, buy them, uh, but definitely go check them out. I paid $110, I think, for it. And I think it's worth it. Really like it. Love the alt modes. Uh, this one I love, especially the car mode looks really, you know, sleek and fast. I love it. Looks really good. And you know, for her, it's like a jump drive or you know, you know, kind of thing like that or a flash drive. You know, you can use whatever you want to. But pretty cool. Like I said, this she's just a straight recolor, just a repaint. Uh, but I do love the you know the nice uh, metallic blue eyes and the pink all throughout and the blue looks really nice. Really good. And the uh, uh, weapons are painted too as well. He can hold these weapons too if you want to. He doesn't have a weapon, but he can hold those weapons if you want. That's pretty cool. Uh, like I said, transformation. Uh, real easy. Uh, just uh, be careful with the new head sculpt. Like I said, it does have this uh, head crest right here. You don't want to snap that off. It's a thin piece of plastic. Uh, just be careful when you're trying to remove it, you know, from the you know chest area. So, yeah, just be wary of that. But other than that, it's an easy transformation. Uh, shouldn't take you that long. Uh, the bot modes look good. I love the sculpt of this one. It looks really nice. It looks, it looks just fast and, you know, like it can cut you up a little bit. Uh, this one, you know, it's fine. You know, you got the 80s one working shoulder pads, but... Looks cool. I like it. Um, the paint wise, really good. Love. Got the spots, the turquoise. Uh, you got gold, gunmetal silver. You got the blue. The metallic blue looks really good. I love the head sculpt on this one. The new head sculpt looks really good. Uh, paint on this one is nice. You know, got the metallic uh, blue visor, the chest, the metallic pink. Really nice and done. So, yeah, great on the paint job. I like that. Um, articulation. Kind of lacking for him, especially I wish he could look up, you know, a little bit, you know, up or anything like that. That would have been nice. Um, the, an ankle rocker, you know, you do have one, but it could be more. It would have been nice with that. So articulation kind of like because he does have an ab crunch. I wish he could look up and, you know, utilize that. Uh, with her, she does have great articulation. You can look up, you know, she has a, a weight uh at crunch uh but yeah really nice on articulation for her i like that um yeah and like i said the materials feel good didn't think i was gonna break anything either one uh like i said just be careful with the head you know kick any uh just be careful with that but overall i think it's a great set you know if you like this kind of this is a great this is a great set for a convention because like i said i don't know the lore of this i don't know if you know if they were in the comics or something you know, i know rewind and chrome dome was in the idw comics but i don't know about these two but, you know, like I said, it's an off-the-wall kind of thing, and it's, it's perfect for a convention. I really like this because, you know, not a lot of people are going to know what this is. So, but, yeah, I do uh, recommend if you get a chance to get it. Uh, I think I think they're limited uh, quantity, so if you want it, you know, hurry up and get on Toy Dojo or Ages 3 and up, and uh, you can get that as well. So, yeah, like these, okay? They're really cool. Uh, so, hit me up some likes, shares, prayers, and care bears. Hit that sub button for me if you don't mind. Uh, hit me up some comments, some of you thought of the review. If you like this or you're going to get this. And I guess I'll see you in the next Transformer review. And as always, be good to yourself. Man, hell freaking Transformers and hell freaking MMC and hell freaking BotCon. And good night, folks. Well, hey there, everybody. How y'all doing? All right. So quick question. Uh, do y'all pick up the exclusives when y'all go to uh, conventions or anything like that? Like I said, this uh, this group right here is a perfect perfect thing for the you know convention because it's not like you know optimus prime or some hard to get kind of things it's just you know off the wall off you know one shoots or something uh but yeah i think the cheetor and the rosanna are really really great for the convention and yeah do you pick up any exclusives so 
Yeah, floor time. Gotta love it.